it was helpful, but it it did it doesn't feel like anyone's ready to pay it back today. The deadline to repay back the Canada Emergency Business Account loan is here, but some businesses say they're not ready. Riley Grace is a variety store in Winnipeg's Corden neighborhood. The business just paid back their SIBA loan on the 12th, but it now also means they have less money in their bank accounts. The funds that we make in the busy season, which would be November, December, usually we hold on to that to help us through January, February, the slowest months. Um, so we did pay it off, but now we don't have that kind of reservoir um, that we usually plan to have. It's the same situation over at Galaxy Printing, where the business also managed to pay off their SIBA loan ahead of Thursday. Genoa Cox, a co-owner of Galaxy Printing, says while business has been picking up, their ability to purchase new equipment or hire new staff is limited after paying off their loan. We were looking at uh, our bank account, and it definitely does make an impact uh, with how we are going to be running our business for uh, this upcoming year. Uh, it will be difficult to reinvest into our business and help us grow. But for gym owner Angelo Manfredi, he still has about $4,000 left on his loan. Well, it's kind of a double-edged sword in the sense that they close you down, and then they give you money to stay afloat. But then at the same time, if I was allowed to operate, I wouldn't need it. According to the Canadian Federation of Independent Business, over 23,000 small businesses across Manitoba took out a SIBA loan, with 17% of the CFIB membership expecting not to be able to pay the loan by Thursday. In many ways, it's more stressful to be in business now than it was at the height of the pandemic, just because costs have increased, business owners have seen every line item in their budget go up. The SIBA loan allowed small businesses and nonprofits to borrow up to $60,000 interest-free with 33% of the loan forgiven if it was repaid by Thursday. For those trying to still take advantage of the partial loan forgiveness, companies like Merchant Growth are seeing people rush to refinance their SIBA loans. It has been wild. There's a whole industry of non-bank lenders. Uh, we use technology you can apply online. We make it really convenient. And it's just important for people to be aware of that because otherwise there's just a lot at stake here. In Winnipeg, Edward Jan, City News.